here's my suggestion to the NCAA. Are you guys uh, interested in hearing this right now for expanding the tournament? Wow. Okay. Hit, hitting us early. Yes, I am. I'm going to get this out there early. And with a little help from uh, a, a source close to the NCAA. So here it is. If you expand the field beyond 68, we talked about this yesterday, it should ideally expand to 80. Follow me here. This would give each of the four regions a first four. So you would have four 20-team regions. Each of the first four could take place in one of the venues where the Thursday, Saturday, Friday, Sunday games are. That means less travel time for the teams. Easier for fans to travel to one place and more flexibility regarding timing and the rest of the teams involved. Expanding to 72 or 76 would still leave one or two regions uneven in terms of you know, the fairness there. But if you go to 80, that makes the most sense. So I'm doing that as a favor to the NCAA tournament. Go to 80. I don't like expanding it, first of all. But if you're going to, then do it where it makes sense for all involved. Each region gets a first four and then there's less travel, and then when you win your game, you're going to stay, and then you'll play if you win on Wednesday, then you play on Friday, Tuesday you play on Thursday, and then everybody's happy. NCAA gets more teams in there, coaches are happier, we get more basketball, and the NCAA gets some more money. Yeah, Paul? Do you know why this idea is easier to consume? Because you're not taking away the 64-team field. It's like a pre-tournament tournament. tournament. Yeah. So you will still keep the idea of a 16-seed beating a one seed. It's now you're playing for the chance to be the 16 seed, which is what's happening right now. So you don't remove, it won't be 96 teams. There will be, you know, no more 16 ones, which we're used to. This prevents that going away. Yeah. It just seems if you do the math, it's very simple. That doesn't mean the NCAA will do it, uh, but they're not going to 96. I was told that, but they're, they are going to expand. The question is, will they do it after this tournament or will it be next year's tournament? And, uh, I'm thinking maybe it's, you know, 80. If you do 80, round number, math works, and everybody will be happy with that. I mean, the first four in in different regions, I, I think we'll all be okay with that. And then you get into the tournament. You still get into the tournament, and, you know, we don't dampen that. But if you're going to have 80 in there, maybe the math looks good, and maybe that's what the NCAA does.